So far, we have learned about relevant cost and opportunity costs. Relevant costs are future cash flows that differ between alternatives. Opportunity costs are the net cash flow of alternatives that are not selected. An additional important aspect of using costs for decision making is the concept of sunk costs. Sunk costs are cash flows that happened in the past. When looking at the various alternatives to a decision, the only cash flows that matter are future cash flows. Sunk costs are irrelevant. The reason is simple. The past cannot be changed. Thus, these cash flows are the same regardless of the alternative selected. This fact is sometimes difficult to accept, and people wrongly include costs and revenues incurred in the past in certain alternatives and exclude them from others. It is therefore important to remember that sunk costs are irrelevant because they equal across alternatives. For example, if a company has already paid for an advertising campaign, this cost is sunk. Regardless of whether it has been successful or not, future decisions should not consider how much the company spent on it. At this point, the only relevant cash flows are the incremental revenues of any additional future marketing effort that has been considered. These are relevant because they happen in the future and might differ among alternatives. Despite this clear rationale, many people still fail to apply the concept of sunk costs. People think about how much they paid for a computer, car, or bike when they want to sell it, even though that fact cannot be changed. A more useful line of thought is to consider the alternatives to selling these assets and then compare the potential cash flows of each one.